Mr. Ofomo was recently sworn in as an officer with the Texas Department of Corrections. During his time at Irving ISD's adult education program, Eric was a champion for learning. And despite already having a degree in his home country of Cameroon, his hunger for knowledge has never ceased. I want to thank once more uh, my classes, my classmates, our teacher for what he has done for us. In August 2015, she started a four and a half year journey when she became an AEL participant. It took a combination of grit and humility along with a steady dose of dedication to finish her high school equivalency. Adriana is now able to have the career she's wanted for years, working as a dental assistant at a local dentistry office. I would like to thank everyone that believe in me. It's never too late to be successful in life. Thank you so much. The smile on Alexia's face says it all. She's on her way to the top. Alexia is living proof that hard work pays off. When she began taking high school equivalency courses, Alexia was shy, but a few weeks into the program, her self-confidence skyrocketed. Her new goal is to become a registered nurse. I want to thank my family for continuing to show me support and giving me endless love. It said it demonstrates that education changes lives, and she's not wasting any time. Itzel has a contagious enthusiasm and a deeply caring personality that allows her to balance her classes and her job while also being a wife, mother, and grandmother. I do not want end without taking God, my husband, my teacher Irene, and Region 20 Adult Educ- Education Program. Adriana Almeida will be the first to tell you that she almost quit. Overloaded with homework and anxiety, it was the voice of her firstborn son that helped turn the tide. I mean, he said, you've never given up on anything, so you're not about to give up right now. Having enrolled in Victoria College's adult ed program, Adriana plans to pursue higher education in the nursing field. It's a scary part, but once you're there, you'll be more than happy to see how far you can take yourself. It just takes a little hard work, but it's worth it. 37-year-old Leslie Medina has turned a new page in her life. Born with cerebral palsy, Leslie has proved against all odds that with true grit, her dreams can become a reality. Leslie has shown optimistic dedication to her self-improvement, a priceless value that shines through her smile. What I plan to do with my degrees is go to work. Go to work, 100% go to work. 